4th of August, uh, our community celebrated the opening of Edafal's CFA station. This is a journey uh, 10 years long and started uh, back with a lovely gentleman of our community, 88-year-old uh, John Hennessy, who gave up his land next door to the CFA when volunteers came knocking and said that they needed the site next door. Instead of selling to the developers at hundreds of thousands of more than what he could have achieved, he decided to support the volunteers that support our local community. And so on, uh, on the weekend, we celebrated this incredible outcome with hundreds of people and the 130 volunteers that underpin the Edafal CFA. Uh, volunteers, integrated brigades and career staff came together for this incredible milestone. And to John Hennessy, we thank you for your generosity. It was then Jenny Lindell in, 2000 and, uh, in 2009 who secured the land with a, with a $950,000 grant. It was Wade Noonan, the then Shadow Minister, who joined me for that very announcement and committed to rebuild the Edafal CFA. And on the 90th year anniversary, we celebrated with the previous Emergency Services Minister, Jane Garrett, where we unveiled the exciting and wonderful plans for this station. And it was James Molino where we opened, where we first demolished that station. It is a Labor government that has supported through this journey Edafal CFA and to open their new station, I pay tribute to Graham Fountain, the captain and all the volunteers.